Hello everyone, Solomon here, and today we're going to be playing Phoenix Wright Ace Attorney Justice for All. I played the first one and the third one, but this, this one, this, which is the second one, I never played. So, without further ado. Episode 1 The Lost Turnabout. How did I get into this mess? That's far enough. You can't run forever, Mr. Phoenix Wright. What? What have I done wrong? I cannot allow you to go on like this. Huh? But, but I'm just a simple defense attorney. Silence! You are no longer worthy of your title. September 8th, 9.08 a.m. District Court, Defendant Lobby, number one. <laughs> Phoenix Wright is not amused. What a nightmare. And I bet it was this ringtone that caused it. I really shouldn't be dozing off right before trial starts anyways. Huh, looks like they hung up. Well, who are you? Ah, oh, good, I finally found it. Talk about a close call. I hate to do this to you, but... <laughs> it's nothing personal, Mr. Attorney. Few minutes later, District Court, Defendant Lobby Number One. Ouch! My head, swabbing, and why does it feel so foggy in there? Oh, hello. Good morning. Ack. Uh, good good morning. What's wrong? You look well. People are at their best first thing in the morning. Where's that fighting spirit? Sorry, but can you please turn the turn to cheering me as cheering this down? My head sort of hurts. Roger that. Um, am I in trouble or something? Huh? Trouble? Well, wait. Never mind. You're a policewoman, right? I thought maybe I had done something wrong. But what are you talking about? I'm the one. I'm the one in trouble. What? I'm placing my life in, in your hands today, Mr. Phoenix, right? Life in my hands? You promised me! You said you would prove that I was not guilty! N not guilty? Just when I thought all hope was lost, when all the other lawyers had laughed me off. Leave it to me, you said. You, the one and only Phoenix Wright, came to, came to save the day. Oh boy. <laughs> and just like that, I was moved to tears, sir. And looks like we to you again. I'll never forget what you were. Nah, I'll never forget what you're doing for me, ever! What is this girl babbling about? Actually, I really love to watch court proceedings. Oh, court proceedings. And I always root for you to win. When I'm off duty, I like to come here and... What's wrong? You've been acting real strange. And you, kept, and you keep staring at me. You make me kind of nervous, sir. Oh, oh, sorry. Hmm, I'm afraid to ask, but here goes. So, this might sound bad, but, uh... Who are you? What? Mr. Wright, how can you say that? How do you do this to the fragile heart of a girl about to go on trial? You're absolutely horrible! N no, I, I mean, I didn't mean it like that. I, this is how a defense attorney treats his client, sir? I can't believe this. No, it's just, well, I... I think you have the wrong person. I'm... Yes, I'm... I'm... Who am I? Why am I trying to blink? Oh no, he has amnesia. Even though I've kind of thought about that for a little bit now. The trial begins short. Oh, wait, who's that? The defendant and her lawyer please proceed to the courtroom immediately. The trial's about to start. Count on you in there, okay? Oh boy, this is going to be interesting. Hmm, I guess I must have a Misha. <laughs> well, how do you know what a Misha is? 
What do you mean, Let's see, what can I piece together? Hmm, from our conversation, I can safely say that I'm probably a defense attorney. How do I know what that is? And that girl. I said I'd prove her, I'd prove her not guilty. I can't believe I made such an irresponsible promise. Well. Ah, someone, please! Tell me this is just a bad dream! Why do I get the feeling? This is one dream I won't be waking up from. Mm. September 8th, 10 a.m. District Court, courtroom number 2. <clears throat> Court is now in session for the trial of Maggie Bird by Bride. Maggie Bride? Bird, it's either Bird or Bride. Maggie Bride. Maggie Bride? I'm just, because almost all these names have puns in them, so. Maggie, Maggie Bird. I'm gonna go with Bride. Be ride Be ride Maggie be ride Ugh. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. Uh, what is it, Mr. Wright? Um, er, uh, are you talking to me? Do you see any other defense attorneys here? I guess not. <laughs> now then, are you ready? Yes. I guess I should say yes, for now. Are you ready, Mr. Wright? Yes, Your Honor. Wait a sec. If... Her life is in my hands. I should really do the responsible thing. Actually, you see, uh, Your Honor, my memory's kind of. The court will not hear the defense's excuse. Defense's excuse. But because, because the defendant is a member of the police, this case is under great s scrutiny. Therefore, we must make this trial fair but swift. I believe I have told you this before. I hope you're not telling me you've forgotten. Actually, I did. Mr. Payne, your opening statement, please. Yes, Your Honor. As I'm sure you're well aware, the defendant is accused of killing her lover. What's worse, her lover was a fellow police officer. A policeman? You did what to a policeman? It wasn't me! And besides, Dustin and I, we weren't lovers like that. In any case, the prosecution will prove that the guilty party is none other than the defendant. Very well. Mr. Payne, please call your first witness. <laughs> it's been a while, Mr. Wright. Let's see what you've learned since last time. I won't show any mercy this time, Rick. I won't show you any mercy this time, Rookie. Okay, and who are you again? Please bring Detective Dick Gumshoe to the stand. My favorite, my favorite character in the series. Maybe except Venus Wright. Here we go. Don't please don't let me tell, Mr. Wright. Nowhere to hide. I'm so dead. <clears throat> Witness, please see your name and occupation. Uh, my name is uh, Dick Gumshoe, sir. Uh, I'm the detective in charge of homicides down at the Princeton. Sir, you don't look very well, detective. Well, sir, the defendant, uh, she works under me, so, uh, you know. You work under that, you work under that detective? Yes, sir. And while I was a trainee, he was always watching out for me, sir. Sir, he's such a wonderful guy, sir. I'll never forget what he's done for me. Okay, calm down, I believe you. Detective Gansu, please describe for us the details of this murder. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, it happened in, at the park near headquarters. Expose Park. The victim was one of the local cops, Dustin Prince. He was pushed down from the benches on the upper pass, sir. The landing beat up his body. Look, the landing beat up his body pretty bad and snapped his neck. The details are listed in the report that was distributed yesterday. Ah, yes, the autopsy report, correct? Why do I not remember getting a copy? I see everything's in order here. Even the estimated time of death is unusually well documented. The victim's watch stopped from the impact of the landing, sir. The results of the autopsy confirmed the time of death. If I may, Your Honor, the prosecution would like to submit this photograph. Very well, the court accepts it into evidence. Crime photo 1 added into the fort to the court records. Now then, I recall that yesterday's preliminary hearing, a very important piece of evidence was brought to our attention. Yes, Your Honor. Uh, yes, sir. Yes, I guess? Mr. Wright, is your head on right today? 
Then it was a wrist where was a very crucial piece of evidence found underneath underneath the victim's body. Um, was there? Have you lost your mind? Well, actually, um, it's just uh, nerves. Give me a second. What? How can you talk like such an amateur? I thought you were a pro, sir. All right, sir. I'll help you through this. At a time like this, maybe you ought to take a glance at the court record. The court record? Yeah. Info about evidence and people involved with this case are all listed there, sir. You can take a look at this court record by touching the, the court record button. The court record button? You really know what you're talking about, huh? It's too bad I'm a cop, right? Just think, I could totally be a legal... <laughs> oh, excuse me. Aid instead. Mr. Wright. Uh, yes, your honor? Court is in session. Save your chit-chat for later. Uh, s sorry, your honor. Well, I guess I better check the court record and see what I can find. What was it again? The court record button? Alright, Mr. Wright, let's see if you or if your notes are in order. What was the piece of evidence found?